So you guys are all excited about all of the things happening in Royal High right now. Trust me, so am I. We've just had a brand new update. We know the new school is coming. We know they are working on more updates to come before summer begins. We know that there's going to be potentially another set maybe coming in the future as well for spring. Maybe not, might be summer, who knows, but probably might be. There may also be a mermaid halo. We also know that there's lots going on that we should be excited about. And Callan told us right at the beginning of the year that 2021 was going to be the best year for Royal High. And so far, I would agree and say he was telling the truth. But you guys, we are not even halfway through the year yet. So there's still plenty more to come. Today, we are going to go ahead and spill some more tea about the new school and various other parts of the game that Lance talks about in his stream recently. And I'm so excited to share all of this with you all. Hold on to your hats, everybody. This is going to be exciting. Hey, little beans, I made my own TikTok account. I've been posting real life videos, even crazy dance videos in Roblox and also lots of Royal High videos every single day. Be sure to go and follow me. Hello wonderful little beans, my name is B, and welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful day today and thank you so much as always for tuning in to another video on my channel. I'm so excited you guys because we have so much tea and so much news to talk about today. Lance really does like to talk and chat about things going on with the school and the game in general whenever he's live streaming. So I know, I know you're all going to be excited when we talk about this. So let's not waste any time little beans because we have got lots to get through. Let's get going. Hey everyone, I'm Dolly and welcome back to another video. I hope you guys are all having a great day and thank you so much once again for joining in with my channel. You guys are so awesome. I appreciate you. I love you so much. And thank you, thank you so much for coming to check out the video. You guys are all so amazing. I love you, I love you, I love you. And of course, if you'd like us to reply to your comments and read them, please do leave some comments down below. We love reading them all and we will of course try to do our best to respond to as many as possible. Absolutely, you guys make sure to comment down below we read all of them and we really appreciate all of your love and support let's get started with today's tea so first things first you guys sticks and tricks tweeted for us this from lance's live stream he said we've heard this before but they're working on translating the upcoming school into other languages might not be available on initial launch but that is still a thing so in other words you guys if you are somebody who would really like to be able to play royal high in your native language if that is not english this is an an exciting opportunity because the brand new school will eventually be fully and professionally translated into multiple languages so that you guys can of course enjoy the game without using Roblox's strange translation system which doesn't always work. It will be professionally translated to make sure everything makes sense and I'm so looking forward to that you guys because you all deserve to be able to play this game in your language of choice. Stix also tweeted, we haven't heard about the new school obbies in a while. However, they still have the obbies Vianchi made and Lance can't say what they are for. I believe that's what they're discussing here anyways. It wasn't very specific. So in case you guys were worried about these obbies, don't worry at all. They are still being worked on. We still have them coming to the game and Lance can't tell us what they are for. Which means it must be something exciting, you guys, because why else would they keep it a secret? I don't know about you, Little Beans, but I am really, really excited to see exactly what they're working on here. And personally, I am wondering, really, really wondering, what is going on with these obbies? What could it be for? Who knows, little beans, but maybe we'll find out later. Six also tweeted, again, Suki is fine. She's having ups and downs right now, but the last time Lance spoke to her, she was doing pretty good. Lots of you guys have been worried or concerned about Suki Meki and asking lots of questions, obviously because you have been worried about her, but you guys, please try not to worry too much. She really is just taking some time away. Sometimes people just need it. Sometimes we just need to switch off. Sometimes living online, you guys, and having an online life can be difficult for some people and sometimes you just need some time away. So please be respectful of Suki, you guys, and remember she's doing okay and just needs a little bit of time away from the computer. Now, in case you guys didn't know, there does seem to have been a glitch recently in Royal High that was causing people to become noobs in the game, even though you actually aren't one. In other words, resetting you to the original Roblox characters with no items, even though you actually earned all of the things before. The devs are actually aware of this, and Lance did talk about it on his recent stream. As you can see, Stig said, if you're wondering about the glitch turning people into noobs until they reset, he's aware and telling Ice. Unsure if Royal High related 
of Roblox related. Lance said he's telling Ice that it sounds like a Roblox wide issue. Don't worry, it'll be resolved sooner or later. I think if you reset, it's fine anyway. So you guys, it sounds as though Lance is not sure if it's actually a Royal High problem or a Roblox problem in general, but no matter what, they are working on it and it will eventually be fixed. So try not to worry and reset your character if you need to, if anything strange happens to you. Lance also confirmed the Easter update is likely staying until the end of the month. It is quite uneventful, so they're in no rush to get rid of it. So never wears little beans, there is a chance that we might actually get to keep the update throughout May as well and continue enjoying the gorgeous update that we've had for April, which has really brought a lot of us together and we have all really, really enjoyed. And you guys, Rainbow Chloe also said there's new patterns made by Reddy that have been added to the game. As you guys can see, we have all new patterns added by Reddy the Teddy into the game. Thank you, Kit Car, of course, for the implementation. These are so cute, you guys, and you may recognize these textures, and there's a reason why. As you can see, Mr. Siren Blue said, I think only because if you look at these closely, these patterns were used on the eggs. I could be wrong, but they really look like the designs on the Easter eggs in the hunt. And you guys, Kit Car confirmed they are. I had forgotten to add them with others, so I sent them in with the stories last weekend. I will send more patterns to Barbie the last week of April for May's update as well. In case you wanted to be able to wear an outfit that actually looks identical to the textures we get on the Easter eggs, you now can, Little Beans. All of the textures that Reddy has made are actually used on the Easter eggs and are now in the game as well. So let's go ahead, you guys, and I am going to recolor my dress because I love wearing all the big textures in my dress, you guys. They're always so cute. So let's have a scroll down, and as you can see, all of these new textures by Reddy the Teddy are here and available for you to wear. And you guys can clearly see these are actually very, very cute textures. I love that one, you guys. They're like plaid design. That is so pretty. They are so cute, you guys, and you can wear them on your items, of course. And they are all, obviously, the textures that we've already seen on the Easter eggs. Personally vibing with this orange one, you guys. It's giving me summer vibes. I love that. These are honestly really pretty. Reddy has done an amazing job with these. So cute. There we go, you guys. We look like we are ready for summer in this outfit. Look at how pretty we are. So beautiful! And you guys, I am going to pop on screen right now a piece of fan art from another one of you wonderful little beans who sends me fan art in my Discord. Thank you so much for being so wonderful. You're all amazing, and I appreciate you more than you will ever know. Thank you so much for all of your amazing support, and I hope you enjoy, obviously, the showcases. And of course, if you guys would like your fan art to be showcased, be sure to come and join my Discord and leave your fan art in the fan art designated chat so I can showcase yours on the video as well. Thanks so much, everyone. You're all wonderful, and I appreciate all of you for taking time out of your day to draw me and Dolly. Now, you guys, that is all the tea we have for today. I hope you found this interesting and useful in some way, and I hope you are as excited as I am for the future of the game, of course. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. I really do appreciate it. If you enjoyed today's video, please don't forget to leave a like. We're going to aim for 250, as always. And don't forget to boop that little subscribe button, you guys. We're getting so close to 85,000 subscribers. And, of course, once we hit 90,000, we're giving away this beautiful spring halo you can see on my head right now. Have a great day, everyone. I love you all lots, and I'll see you all very, very soon in the next video. Bye, everybody. Click that bell. Bye!